So hey guys, Magnus Robert here, bringing you another update video, talking about a brand new update that's come out. Uh, it came out yesterday, I, I apologise, it's a tad late, uh, just uh, I was asleep when it came out, so... Um, anyway, this is the Springfield Badlands, or the Springfield Wild West update, as it's been renamed, I guess... They didn't stick with the Badlands, and it's got nothing to do with the Badlands whatsoever. <laughs> uh, I kind of suspected this when they released that picture a couple of days uh, they, they released the picture on Monday. Uh, I did do a video on that. I didn't think it was going to come out today, uh, on Tuesday or, well, Wednesday, whatever. Uh, I didn't think it was going to come out on Tuesday, but it did. Um, which is okay, I guess. Generally, I mean, like, or. Well, at the minute, I'm not really too sure where I stand on this update. I'm probably going to have to uh, kind of see Act 2 and Act 3 before I make a final judgment. But at the minute, I'm kind of in the middle. Um, so for a start, we've got, obviously, the crafting thing. Yay. They brought the shitty crafting back, and it's just it's just pissing me off, this. I I really don't like the crafting ability. It's, it's, not, it's a really poor way of doing it, in my opinion. Especially when you're, like, crafting, you know, you have to get... Two separate uh, amounts of the either pickaxe and the hat. Uh, it's just a rehash. It's not very creative. They're just rehashing what they did with the other updates, with the obviously the monorail update and all that. I mean, they just need to come up with something new. Um, really, they really do. Um, but whatever. That's kind of like how you unlock some prizes, and obviously you have the normal prize way thing as well. Uh, the obviously Act One, Act Two, Act Three, which I kind of like that. Uh, so you don't unlock it all at once. Uh, so now, obviously, we've got some characters here. We've got, obviously, the old West Simpsons. Really pissed off that they didn't get the um, the Colonel Homer costume. Uh, it would have made more sense than this Cowboy Homer. Um, obviously, got a bar costume for Bart. And what I think is pretty cool, a costume for Maggie. Uh, that that I, I do actually like that one. Uh, we've also got the Old West partners. Here we have Gummy Joe. Uh, he's kind of a smallish character. We have uh, Luke Stenson. We have uh, Buck McCoy. There and we also have a tumbleweed. Apparently, that's now a character. <laughs> um, we also have one for Skinner there. I forgot to mention a uh, long shot Skinner, as it's called. Uh, there is also meant to be an outlaw. S oh, I'll say that in a minute. Um, so yeah, I mean that's pretty cool, I guess. Um, I'm re the tumbleweed's really unique, actually. I, I kind of like that. In a way, it's a bit weird. And a bit crappy, I guess, but in a, in another way, it's kind of I kind of like it. I kind of like it. It's, I like it when they do these really strange, unique characters. Uh, but Buck McCoy, he's definitely a bigish character. Uh, Gummy Joe is kind of also. I mean, he's appeared in a couple of episodes. Uh, and then we move on to uh, the uh, criminals, I guess. Uh, you have um, if I go, we have we uh, Wes do is it Dubna? And we also have Outlaw Snake. The Outlaw Snake is coolish, I guess, but the one I actually do like, I do like West Dubner. Uh, it's obviously a costume for Sideshow Bob. That is really cool. Um, you know, it completely makes him look completely different, which I do like. And I actually didn't think it was Sideshow Bob at first when I uh, first got it. I, I thought it was a completely brand new character. Now, of course, uh, we have so a lot of buildings. So here you can see the tiles, the new tiles. We have two new tiles. We have a dirt tile, and we also have like a pathway, uh, kind of dirty pathway, which which I do like. I do like these new two tiles. It's really cool to have them, and I like it. And I like it. And I like it. Uh, also, you have the saloon, which you eventually obviously build up. You can build up the two um, buildings next to it, which you can see are like halfway there by leveling a lot up. You also have the general store there. And some fences and a horse and that. Uh, so And the rock there. There's different decorations you can unlock. Uh, here we have the film set. Or the, the obviously the western film set. With, that comes with Buck McCoy. Uh, we have obviously the, the, the banks there I think. Oh no that's not the bank. There's some other stuff there as well. Uh, there's like a barber shop and stuff. And you have that big me um, metallic. Metallic? I don't know. Metal thing. Uh, that big spider thing. I, I think that's a spoof on... Um, uh, the movie, what's it called? I forget the movie, but um, yeah, yeah. So a, a lot of different buildings, and also you have the cactuses there, which are pretty cool. Um, so the horse carriages as well. Some pretty cool decorations we've got. I'm not gonna list all the buildings because, honestly, um, there's just so many. Uh, but I mean, there is a lot on the wiki anyway. Uh, there's a lot of buildings. Obviously, here we have the, uh, what is that? Uh, we have the, obviously the barber's shop, the bank. And whatever the heck that is there. Um, but yeah, I mean, overall, I'm pretty... The the amount of buildings is pretty cool. We've got a really cool range of buildings. Um, 
if I just list them to you now, we have got the Town Plaza, which is the saloon. Uh, we have the General Store, the Bank, the co the co Coral, ca ca Coral, I don't know. Uh, we have the Barber Shop, we have the Orn Ornance Express, Park. Part and Parallel Postal, which is a postal, I guess. Uh, Wilfred Rose, which I'm not really too sure. Was that that building up there that you just saw? I think it was. Um, you had the Hootenanny Hootena Bar, uh, Barn, sorry. We had the Blacksmith, the Seeds and Feed and Seed, uh, West Dubner's Rib Hat Hut, which is the thing that Sideshow Bob's costume came with, and the Wild West film set. Uh, also returning is Fort Sensible, and then you have a bunch of rocks. This is decorations we're going on to now. A bunch of rocks, just some some stage coaches, uh, you know, a couple of signs and stuff. There's a water tower. Some there's some pretty cool decorations uh, by the looks of it. Uh, and I feel like the problem with this update is. Um, a lot of these are just decorations, and there is a really, really... And it's cool to get a vast amount of decorations and the new tiles, but it feels like they're just cramming a load of shit um, with, you know, the new towel tiles and the new decorations. And I like, I like, I like the new decorations and the new tiles. Now, I'm going to nitpick, because let's just go through some things that I've kind of briefly gone over. Now, for a start, let's go for characters. There isn't that many characters in this update, which kind of annoys me. The only kind of bit new characters we've got is Gummy Joe. Now, if I just look on Gummy Joe on Wikipedia, because that's what I used to do. He's appeared in two episodes, um, and he's appeared in the comics as well. But he's literally only appeared in two episodes, so he's not... I do... I do... He does He does ring a bell, but, uh, you know, he's not a massive character. Then we have Luke... St St oh, Luke, I'm just going to call him Luke, I can't. Uh... He's only appeared in one single episode, I, I believe, oh, I'm trying to think back to that episode, I can't really remember it, um, but yeah, he's only appeared in one, then you have Buck McCoy, Buck McCoy's a bit of a bigger character, oh no he's not actually, oh he's only appeared in one episode, uh, I do remember, I do actually remember that episode quite a bit, uh, but he also did appear in the movie, but that doesn't really count does it, and then you obviously have the tumbleweed, and the tumbleweed literally is just something the game's made, I think there was actually a reference to it back in the Simpsons, I do believe that, it, I, I do remember like Homer or someone saying that, oh that tumbleweed's like a person or something, I don't know, I I, I, I might just be thinking that up in my head, but um, also nitpicking, uh, obviously we obviously have a lot of skins, or character, yeah skins, character skins. Now the Sideshow Bob one I'm pretty happy with, I mean the the Outlaw Snake, it's okay, it's not it's not like that special, but it's pretty cool, I really like the one for Maggie, that's, that is really cool, the one for Bart I'm not really, I'm not really, you know I don't really care for it, the one with Skinner I don't really care for it either, uh, the one with Homer though really pisses me off, because, um, they could. This is a perfect opportunity to add a Colonel Homer or Major Marge. I do feel like that may still be a gill offer down the line. I am. I'm, I'm. I'm having my. Um, I have a suspicion that they're gonna add the. Uh, uh, the. The cowboy. The fancy dress. The cowboy fancy dress store. That. Um, uh, that Homer gets his um Colonel Homer from. I have a really big suspicion they're gonna add that as a gill offer. Maybe with the major Marge costume as well, like in my ideas video. Uh, but I'm re I am really annoyed that they didn't add the ma the the Colonel Homer uh as with instead of this cowboy Homer because this cowboy Homer was literally just something. I mean maybe maybe Homer's wore this cowboy outfit before in the Simpsons. I don't know, but I feel like the Colonel Homer costume is a lot more rememberable. And if they do make it a girl offer, it's gonna piss me off that they've made it premium because honestly, it's one of those costumes that the it's just kind of Homer's wore it more than once. He's wore it more than one. He's wore it wore it more than one episode. Um. So yeah, moving on. Let's go to the buildings now. Again, none of these buildings uh well some of them are but the majority of these buildings aren't actually in the badlands to my knowledge um now i know that lorleen is it lorleen lives close to the badlands she lives in a small little little kind of village i guess that's in springfield it's, I, i'm not even too sure is springfield meant to be a state i i i never I'm, i don't know but um springfield basically uh to the left of it is all the badlands obviously in the map that I did show in my Badlands Ideas video. And I presume they're going to add, like, you know, the world's largest toilet and all this. But the stuff that it actually is in the Badlands, however, they didn't. And they didn't. And it, it kind of it kind of annoys me. Um, But, um, yeah, anyway, I mean, there's not really much more to say. I mean, I've got to kind of see Act 
Act 2 and Act 3. So far, if I was to give it like a like or dislike, I'm going to have to give it a dislike on this one. I don't... Just about, it's just on the verge of a dislike, but mainly mainly because they kind of they kind of hyped it so much and I, I don't well they didn't hype it like loads but like they hyped it a little bit and honestly it's it's not that amazing it, it really isn't i mean the tiles are cool and that but at the minute i'm kind of on the edge because i like the tiles and i like i like some of the new characters they're pretty cool the new skins and i like i like all these buildings to be honest uh, they gave us another strip of land as well and there's some other stuff they've done um with the game obviously they've uh, updated all the kind of uh, task things that you can now uh, you know it now tells you if the task's done on your ta on the side of the taskbar and all that which I, I really like and i like i like i like that a lot um but of course, uh, it brings some cool stuff, but it brings some negative stuff. So I'll have to see. Um, so anyway, guys, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Please comment, re-subscribe, really tell me your thoughts on this update, and I shall see you next video. Goodbye.